Hey there, Survivors Cougar here, back on our rapidly greening planet, Humble Planet. And we've just unlocked the Tier 2 Tree Spreaders. So it is time to get some trees grown. We've got three tree seeds that we found in a spaceship. So we can make three of these. And hopefully we have enough... I didn't check our power before we started this, but hopefully we have enough power to get these down without or everything grinding to a halt. It'd be good to have some... Ah, nope, I should have checked my power before we started. Um, that is actually going to be a problem then because we're running a little low on uranium. Um, I do have a uranium, a tier 2 mining platform out here in what I assumed to be a uranium cave. There's no uranium, uh, uranium gr like growing in there. There was some there originally but you know usually it's glowing green or something where you can mine uranium and um it's not glowing green in there so i'm not sure if we're actually going to get any uranium out of this oh we have a butterfly dome we've also unlocked um beehives and some other cool stuff we should be seeing larva lying around on the ground soon if not now uh in the original game, you had to stand still for a minute before it started popping in. I don't see any larva. But let's check this, which is... Yeah, I put this where I thought we might be able to get some uranium. But it, it's not pulling in any uranium yet, so I don't know. I don't know. But it is still fun just cruising around, checking out all this stuff that we weren't able to look at before because it was all under ice. Oh, apparently we've looked at this before. And probably... Oh, perfect! Some uranium rods. Great. That's enough for us to build another uranium reactor, which is what we need to get our tree spreaders down. So let's get that happening. Um, see, this is what I mean. So there's uranium in here. They were mining uranium in here, I, it, I assume. We're just not pulling any out yet. Maybe I don't have that thing far enough into the cave. Should we move this? Let's move it. Better safe than sorry. Let's just move it over a few feet. And see if uh, if that helps us. Or maybe this just isn't a place for uranium. And I'll have to find where it is going to come from. That'll do. All right, let's go back and build a, um, a power plant or two. And then we've got some ships to explore. Because, you know, the... The unlocks were coming in fast and furious, and I, I missed some of them. And one of them was apparently the Tier 2 deconstruction chip. So I am now equipped with the Tier 2 deconstruction chip, and we can get into the, the crashed spaceships that we've been seeing lying around. Oh, that reminds me. We can also deconstruct these for circuit boards. Great. Circuit boards for days. Excellent. Let's get some power going. Yeah, we just we found a bunch of rods there. We may be able to build two of these tier two plants. Um, we have unlocked the next one, which is the nuclear fusion generator, but I don't have enough pulsar quartz yet, and I don't have the ability to craft the pulsar quartz yet. So we're gonna have to stick with the nuclear reactors for the time being. Um, I just need a little water. Okay, get it out of our water thingy. Um, seven water is not great. Uh, should I should I make some water? We've we've got ice left. Let's just make a few water. Make sure we have enough before we do this. Oh, I built this, but I never put the tree seed in. Derp. 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 There we go. Those are the only tree seeds we have. Those three. And we do have the DNA manipulator and all that splicing stuff that I have not actually built yet because I don't enjoy that stuff very much. But we will get it built eventually. What am I in here for? Oh, nuclear reactors, right. All right. That's, that'll be plenty of power for us to get some trees going and then get off to explore some spaceships. You know, why don't we just... We'll bring the tree reactors 
that that will build the well hopefully we can build the tree no I, I shouldn't get too far from home trying to build these I do have craft from containers and I've extended the distance that it can pull from containers up to 500 tiles but I don't know if that's going to be long enough to go back where I was thinking of going so let's just do it here tree spreader tree spreaders tier two and one more and we have everything good all right oh wait i gotta put the I keep forgetting to put the seeds in silly yeah because oxygen is really going pretty slowly of, of all the terraforming um benchmarks it's my oxygen that's really struggling right now but that was because i had zero tree spreaders down in part. Look at these. Oh yeah, okay. Some stuff we missed in here. Nope, that was just something I chose not to deconstruct. Okay, that's good. Some goodies. Yeah, we should be getting real good stuff out of these crates now that we're finding late in the process. We were in here yesterday. Yes, and we went down there, I think. Didn't we? Yes, we did. Uh, I'm just taking us the long way around to get to that sp crashed spaceship because we've only been in here once, so we might have missed some stuff. Okay, and frog pools with no frogs yet, but soon. Did we check this? Yep. Crate with good stuff and osmium rod. Nice. I have gotten a little turned around now. I thought we were heading back out to where the spaceship was, but now it looks like we've, we've come into, oh, we've, we've ended up down here. Not where I want it to be, but still. Look, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I fell. Oh dear. Can I get back up without having to go the long way around? Or did I just make this trip much, much longer? Oh, look at it, it's so pretty down here. All right, I've I've taken us well under where we wanted to where we I thought we were going. So, I have to get out of here. Which means going up. Still some ice clinging back in here. There's some wreckage down there. Have we been down there? Oh yeah, I get we looks like no, we have not been here. Okay, cool. I gotta get the materials that we're gonna need for an oxygen chamber too. Hey, look, larva! Okay, a rare larva, good. Lots of good stuff in here, including two rocket engines. Super. We are filling up our inventory pretty fast, though. Super alloy. More larva. Common. Common. I'll take all your common and rare larva. Sure. And uncommon. Good. Um, yeah, more larva there, but we need to get our oxygen situation sorted. We should have a breathable atmosphere pretty soon. We've got the air filter equipped. So that's helping. And of course, the, the ground cover now makes it much harder to pick out the materials. 
that you need to make these chambers. Um, silicon. We're going to have to do this quickly. We do have some oxygen on us from our gas extractor. But, yeah, we're going to have to use one here. Because I'm not finding the titanium that we're going to need. There's some... One more titanium and we should be good to go. We do not have to use an oxygen capsule. Hey, and get some water while we're here. Oh, look at how full our... Oh, we don't need to get water. We have... We now have unlocked the water filtration feature for our spacesuit. So I can just go and drink. And there seems to be water just about everywhere. We will need food, though. Did I bring any food? I brought one food. Let's eat it. And look at this very full backpack of ours. Hmm. Our trip to the spaceship got sidetracked by finding all these goodies down in here. Um. So we may have to make a run home and drop all this stuff off before going to the spaceship. Can I get out through here? I don't know these caves yet at all. I've hardly been down here at all. Uh, what, do we, what can we get rid of? Um, because I do want that explosive powder. I'll get rid of our common larva because they seem to be everywhere. And now let's try and get out of here. Looks like up that ramp is the way we want to go. It sure is pretty down here. The textures look great. I, I feel like the textures have been improved over the other, the first planet. Certainly down here. I mean, the, those rock formations just look fantastic. All right, this is the way we came in. Sorry, this was just a spur of the moment decision to take a, a detour through the caves because I hadn't been down here much and it really sidetracked what we were trying to do. But we did end up finding a lot of good stuff. Found this already. Okay, I know where we are. And a quick trip back to base. And now I have the auto storage mod running. So I just hit a button. And it sucks everything out of my inventory into storage containers. So this should be quite a bit quicker. We will not have to skip edit this part out anymore. There we go. Got rid of all that good stuff. There's some stuff that we don't have any of, like the osmium rods, so we're going to have to store those manually. No problem. And then these three rocket engines, I think before we go out, maybe we'll send up three rockets. That'll be the way. Oh, yeah, and the larva? Nope, not the rocket engines. We want those. And let's decode these chips, although I don't think there's anything left to decode at this point in time. Oh, there was. Trade space rocket for trading. And that was it. It decoded, but it didn't un just give me any unlock. That was weird. I wonder what that just unlocked. Who knows? But, oh, yeah, we were going to send up some rockets since we're back. Oh, boy, this place looks great at night, doesn't it? I love the night views. So we've got, I think we're okay. I mean, we can send up some more uranium and iridium rockets. We've got the GPS satellites up. We've got drone visualization rocket. We don't have any drones, so we don't have to worry about that. Seed spreaders. I am concerned we're out of tree bark just because I haven't gone and harvested it in a while. So let's go ahead and just make some, some standard rockets and send them up.
What did I have? Three rocket engines? Yeah, okay, so a couple of these. Okay. Top off on oxygen, maybe get some food. Uh, do you mind if I do a little farming while we're... Oh, nope, I can't. All right. So let's just get some string beans for eating. We've got water, we've got oxygen, and then we've got uraninite, which I'll throw in the crusher. And we're off to find a spaceship. The spaceship that we found on like day two. And it's just been sitting there this whole time, unlooted. That's about to change. Look how green it is. I love that old tree up on the, the outcropping there. Looks really cool. Beautiful. What a great idea for a game. big beautiful tree you're gorgeous even in the yellow light all right let me in finally let me in yay we're in yippee And we have oxygen on us, so we shouldn't have to run back out of here and get low. Circuit boards, good. I'm gonna come out of here with lots of good stuff, including rocket engines and a rubero tree seed. We can make another tree spreader. Circuit boards from all this. a lot of circuit boards we won't have to make. Uh, task requires the utmost discretion. Uh, robotics currently deploying their new autonomous terraforming system on this planet. They're using various drones and technologies to do so. You need to understand, analyze, and find their technology. Well, find should come first, but anyway. And do what you can to interfere with their process, ideally corrupting the drones and making them non-functional. Hmm. So yeah, a, a corporate war a la Subnautica and many other Any other games these days because corporations are bad guys they're the new bad guys they've replaced journalists as bad guys in a world with no bad guys apparently nothing else okay That's it? That's all that's up here? No. Did we miss something? Was there a... There's got to be more than this. But there must have been a ladder that I missed somewhere. No 
ladders here. Hmm. Okay. Well, somewhat underwhelming for our for our our first spaceship. The other ship that we found in the last episode up on top of the ice maze, that was a smuggler's ship. So that didn't have too much stuff in it, which is understandable. But this, I feel like, should have had a little bit more. I guess it's not really two stories. Maybe it is. I don't know. But anyway, we couldn't get up to another story, so I guess we got everything out of there. But, so we'll go home and drop this stuff off. Yeah, I'll just zip home and drop this stuff off. We'll pick this up back at home. See you there. Yeah, on my way back to base, we were passing by some of the uranium and iridium that we called down with the rockets. So I thought we'd stop and pick it up. Because we need the uranium for more power. Oh, poor little rover. Lonesome rover sitting out here on his own. I should really drive him back to base. He looks so lonely out there. Forgotten. Okay. Is that just about everything? Except for the two spacesuits and um, the tree seed and two rocket engines. I'm not going to send up the other rockets right now. I gotta think about what we really need to use them on. But we can leave the space suits here, the iridium here. We might be able to put down that new tree seed on our way elsewhere. Because I wanted to show you guys another cool thing that I discovered when you weren't looking. I wanted to put tree over here, but this is where astro or meteorites land, so maybe maybe we put it elsewhere to make the uranium easier to see. How about over here, if we're still within range? Oh, tree bark we need it also. Shoot. Okay. Well, I'm not going to go back for that, but we do want to get this uranium before we continue on and I show you this neat thing I found. It was not much uranium. There might be more in there. We'll have to wait for it to despawn. But I was out here doing some exploring or gathering or something, and I got to thinking, see that waterfall up there? Where's that water coming from? Um, there's got to be a big lake up there or something. So I went exploring. Let's, I haven't gone up this way before. I don't know if we can. Let's try. This looks like it's going to go down. Yeah, it's going down. Whoa. Yeah, let's not go that way. I mean, I'll, I'll come back and explore that. Can we get up here? Sort of. Looks like it. Okay, good. So I came up here, and lo and behold, another massive spaceship. And the osmium fields out there are all changed now because the environment has changed. They're no longer light sucking. But look at this thing. This thing's huge. And I haven't explored it at all. I don't know anything about it. I wanted to save that to do with you guys. Let me get some water while there, there's water here. And eat those green beans. Nope. Eat the green beans. What happened to my green beans? Shoot. <sighs> my auto store mod robbed me of my green beans. They're now in a storage container back at base. So we will quickly try to find our way in here. And hopefully we find some food in here. Food? No food. But other good stuff. Yeah. 
good stuff, not food. No food. Well, it's my own fault for not thinking to save the green beans that we picked up. Yes, I know my food level's low. Ah, food! Great. And rocket engines, good. Lots more circuit boards. Mutagen, rocket engine. Yeah, I'll deconstruct you. Wow, lots of rocket engines. We will never have to build another rocket engine. And lots of circuit boards. More rocket engines and pulsar quartz. That might be enough pulsar quartz for us to make our first um, plasma generator. Because I had a few that we found in crates and such. Ooh, speaking of crates. And more food. I'm going to go ahead and eat that. And just see what we can stack here. We're going to have to get rid of something um, like this one titanium in order to pick up the explosive powder. And then um, we got to go back and drop stuff off. I mean, we can continue exploring and see if we can stack stuff. You know, if we find stuff that is stackable. But we're probably going to have to come back to finish this. This place is huge. That is terra tokens for trading. Huh. Um, and I can drop a bunch. Let's put a bunch of iron in there and take the terra tokens. That's the first terra tokens we've found for trading. Lots of chips. Spacesuit locker with spacesuits in it. That's all right. I don't care about the spacesuits. Because it's not multiplayer, so I don't care what I look like or what anybody else looks like. Um, another, we need to outrun Sentinel Corp with our autonomous terraforming technology because corporations are evil and we're at war with another corporation. Gotcha. Not sure why I need to deconstruct that. Was there something there that, no, okay. Excuse me, iron, iron, get out of the way. All right, and here's the fusion reactor. We'll have to bring back some fusion cells to get that active. And we may have cleared this out. And I'm a little bit lost. Been there. I think this is the way out. Yeah, this is the way out. Hey, now we can make teleporters. Great. So now we're really moving. Now we can get about this planet quite a bit quicker than we have. So far. This is great. All these goodies. All right, and yeah, as long as we're out here, um, let me show you, no, I'll, I'll show you that thing when we're ready to actually do something with it, which we could do next. Ah, and normally I'd say I'd skip back to base, but isn't this pretty? We're not actually that far from base, and boy, this is gorgeous. Take in the sights as we go. rapidly greening planet. And we'll pick up some tree bark. We can make another tree spreader. 
Starting to get some trees coming in now. Okay. Deposit stuff. What did we not deposit? Looks like we didn't have room for... Yeah, we didn't have room for this iridium rod or that uranium. So we'll put it somewhere else. And the Terra tokens I'm going to put over here with our fancy pants stuff. Including a bunch of blueprint, uh, microchip blueprints. Or, yeah, let's see if... Yeah, okay, no more blueprints to decode for now. So we'll leave those behind. Let's see about getting... Um, some tree bark. Should have a lot. Oh yeah, 20 tree barks. Good. And we could make another tree spreader. Somewhere. Somewhere where it's not going to cause problems. Hopefully. And close enough to craft from the containers. Let's try here. Yep, looks good. Here we go. Now I'm going to drop off the tree bark and pick up a bunch of explosives, and I will show you why. Excuse me. Tree bark, you stay. We don't have enough room for all the tree bark in here. Because we got all these mushrooms to make bio nuggets. All right, tree bark, stay there. And let's check our, where is my explosives here? Let's get 20 explosives and some green beans. And take you back out to where we just were, ish. this way. Is it almost nighttime already? Is the sun going down? Nah, oops, wrong turn. Okay, we're going back out to the osmium fields for a minute. Loaded with explosives. Oh, these look so cool. Now, I don't know if it was the the terraforming that kind of changed the way this whole area looks or the recent update. They did an update and they said that they removed some some darkening fog or something in one of the areas. Um, so I'm not sure. Ooh, it's pretty dark back in here now, though. Oh my gosh, it's like midnight. I can't see a thing. Ah, but that's what I'm looking for right there. So yeah, I was doing exploring back in here. Is there water nearby? Do I have water on me? I have water on me. Doing some exploring back in here and I saw this thing and I came over and it's loaded with blow upables. So I don't know if we need one explosive or a million. But let's try. Let's start with one. Let's just drop one here. And that blew up the whole thing. Okay, cool. So we didn't need to bring all those explosives, but we got them. Maybe we can blow up some more stuff on the way back. 
but this is not a ship. This is some kind of facility. Unless the ship somehow crash landed into the rock. I mean, that does look like a spaceship, a captain's seat. Some stuff. Ladder down. That's blocked. Looks like we're going down. It's spooky in here. These spaceships are spooky. I feel like I have to be quiet in here. I don't know why. That's not deconstructible. More Terra tokens. This place is a maze. I feel like we should be le leaving breadcrumbs. Now look at it this way. Oh, lots of good stuff in here, but I also feel like we're in grave danger of getting lost down here and being trapped forever. Very mazy. Okay, there is the fusion reactor. Oh, this is sad. Poor people. What happened to you all? Gosh, we're never getting out of here. Good stuff. Mm, more good stuff, including a heat multiplier fuse. That's good. Now, don't get me wrong, I am no huge fan of corporations. It's just... I don't know. A little bloodless as an enemy. It's not, it's not really an enemy I can get excited about opposing. Alright, I think we are possibly done here. There was a turning back this way that I didn't check out very closely. What's that? A big safe with some good stuff in it, but nothing super exciting. Hmm. I've never seen a big safe before. Wonder if that's a multiplayer thing. We've been here? No. I don't think so. We'll go down there in a second. Let me just check up here. Tokens, and we're basically out of room to pick up anything else. Can't jump down. 
Let me let me loop around the other way and make sure. Yeah, okay, here's another crate. And we're out of room to carry anything. Drop a couple of iron. I mean, there's some crappy seeds we don't need. Put the Sneepy back and the Pestera back. Get the tokens and the super alloy. We want the mushroom seeds. Maybe drop some... I don't want to drop all the iron. Yeah, I'm going to drop all the iron. Am I? Nolna seeds we'll keep. Lirmas we got to keep. Shangas we can get rid of. Okay. Mushrooms. And a uranium rod, which we actually kind of need pretty badly. Uh, Brelia, you'll stay. We'll keep, take the uranium rod instead. More tokens? Good, we could kept pick up everything from that. And I'm feeling like we probably explored this. This feels somewhat complete. But finding our way out. So this is probably like a door that we need the fusion generator active to open. And we're back out. Okay. All right. Yeah. I mean, I can come back in and give that a, a more thorough going over, but I'm pretty confident that we got everything we were going to get out of there. So good. I think what's left now is to go back and make use of all this good stuff that we've found, like the rocket engines and... Nothing here for us? No? The rocket engines, and did we get any any tree seeds? No more tree seeds. Okay. We got multiplier fuses, though. And uranium rods for power. Boy, it's really... it's. <laughs> who needs tree spreaders? Look at this place! It's fully foliaged. Man. What a difference a few hours makes. Celia seed. I would like the mutagen and the super alloy rod. I think we're going to get rid of that. Super alloy rod probably tops in stuff in terms of stuff we want to keep. Um, fabric, not really. We'll take the mutagen instead of fabric. I believe we've already looted this place. Yes, in fact, it looks like I've been through here post tier two deconstruction chip because there are no circuit boards to be had. Okay. Well, now this really will be just a, a long boring trip back to base. So I'll meet you guys back there. Tier three tree spreader, yay. But well, we haven't really been through the sulfur fields here since um, the planet started changing. So we're taking a look at these. Look at that. That's like a Venus flytrap type of situation. We have no insects yet for you to trap, but we're getting there. We're getting there, buddy. You hang in there. Try not to get too hungry in the meantime. We're almost home. Okay, now that I've got the tree bark out of the tier two biodome, we can send up some oxygen rockets, some plant life rockets. A seed spreader for oxygen multiplier times 1000, yes. Fly! Be free! 
and a plant rocket. Get those plants coming in. And what else? Another seed spreader? Yeah. How many rockets did I pick up? We got one left after this. And another plant rocket. Okay. Now what? Now I need to eat a green bean and dump all the rest of this stuff. Okay, and then what? Um, 13 excluded. Oh, Terra Tokens. Apparently, it doesn't know Terra Tokens. Now we got Oxygen Multiplier Fuses that I gotta get working around tree spreaders. That's, that reminds me, I'm, I'm so used to doing this without the machine optimizers and spreading stuff out, but what I've really gotta do is get it clustered together to use the multipliers. Um, then what? So teleporters, fine. Pulsar quartz needed, but cannot make yet, I don't think. Believe that is made in the bio lab. Yeah, we can't make the pulsar quartz yet. Wasn't it made in the bio lab or was it made in the tier two construction? Not in here. So we have basically all this good stuff. We've got the air filter, we've got the water filter, we've got the tier three jetpack, we've got the good oxygen tanks and backpacks. So nothing needed to upgrade there. So what I gotta do now then is get going with the DNA stuff. Um, which, uh, let me just clean this out while we're here. And do some farming and what? More algae. Actually, I think we're okay on the algae spreaders here. We've got two or three tier twos and a bunch of tier ones. That's probably enough algae to keep us going for a while. So I think uh, we're going to call it an episode here. And I'm going to get started on the DNA stuff. I'm going to make the... DNA manipulator and start manipulating DNA. We've got some larva to work with now and I think that's about it. I would like to figure out where our uranium is going to be coming from on a regular basis. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Oh yeah, and I, I swapped out a bunch of the tier 1 t uh, growing containers for tier 2, so these are all tier 2 now. Upstairs is still tier 1, but that's fine. We'll have actual farms soon. Um, I should get more heat going. We can make the tier 4 heaters now. And I've got a few going out here. Maybe we'll build one before we call it an episode. I think. Well, we'll see how many we can build. Because I do have an optimizer working with them. It looks like we have three. And this is a tier 1 optimizer. So we can accommodate five. So let's see if we can build two more. Here we go. All right. So now we're really heating. And now I got to get some tier four mine uh, drilling stuff down. And get that around an optimizer. Because these tier threes aren't really cutting it anymore. But we are terraforming, guys. Let's a quick look at our terraformation screen. Um, oxygen pretty stagnant. It is climbing very slowly. Okay, it's not stagnant anymore. It's climbing slowly. Heat, climbing slowly, pressure, yeah, we need to get better pressure apparatus going. I have no tier 4 drills yet, so I gotta get some of those going. And our biomass is doing well. Okay, so call it an episode. Thanks for watching, everybody. Stay safe, survivors.